This question that I found online, 6x minus 3y equals 9, solve for y, basically is asking you to get y alone. Now, how can you do that? Well, all the things that are currently being done to y need to get undone. The first thing I'm going to do is move this 6x to the other side. It's currently positive 6x here. To get rid of it, I would subtract 6x from both sides. Those cancel each other out. And on the left-hand side here, I'm left with negative 3y. On the right-hand side, I have 9, and I'm subtracting 6x from that. Now, I don't personally usually write minus 6x on both sides and then show some stuff canceling. I'm just doing that in case you need it to visualize. You may also note that positive 6x on the left simply became negative 6x on the right. Cool. Now, you've got negative 3 times y. How do you undo that multiplication by negative 3? The answer is you can divide everything by negative 3. Divide both the left and right-hand sides by it. These negative threes cancel out, and what I'm left with on the left-hand side here is just y. Oh, look, we solved for y, isolated it, got it alone, just like the question said. Now, because these are two are separated by addition or subtraction, I can actually just divide them each separately by negative three. Nine divided by negative three is actually just another negative three. And negative six x divided by negative three the negatives cancel, 6 divided by 3 is 2, so I end up with 2x. Now, I don't really like the order that those are written in. I like putting my x's first and then my bare numbers at the end. So I'm going to do positive 2x and then minus 3, but that's just me rearranging the terms, right? That's it. Solving for y in this equation is simply getting y alone, and y is 2x minus 3. Now, there's no number that y is here because we weren't told what x is. If we'd have been given a value for x, we could plug it in there and then, you know, use our calculator to get what the value of y is. But currently, it's just based off another letter. It's the way it goes. Thanks for being with me, and best of luck.